You are watching Fab Number 25 by Allison Tapp, Business Customers Procurement Processes and How Context Influences Them. Corporations have come to view procurement as a strategic level concern in developing competitive advantage and organizational buying has become more sophisticated and professional. For B2B marketers, survival and success hinges on making effective judgments about how customers approach vendor selection decisions. It is constructive to recognize the breadth and diversity of vendor choice situations in practice and develop a basis from which to view alternative perspectives on buyer-seller exchanges. To improve our understanding of the procurement process, we need an integrative approach that considers the interrelationships among purchasing constructs that are important in both classic and contemporary views on organizational buying. Buyer power! Purchase importance is the buyer's assessment of the strategic significance of the purchase, reflecting not only the direct cost of a purchase, but also the impact of the purchase outcome on the buying firm's competitive advantage, strategy, and relationships with its own customers. The model shows a link for a hypothesized relationship between the purchase importance and buyer power. This direct relationship suggests that when the purchase is important to the organization, a clear incentive exists to work to increase buyer power. For procurement decisions with higher levels of purchase importance, there will be greater buyer power related to the purchasing process. Purchase importance. Purchase importance has direct negative impact on procedural control because less important buying decisions are delegated down to the organization. It may be programmed or automated. On the other hand, if the savings from automated decision making is small relative to the total value of the purchase, or if there is a downside risk to applying standard procedures, there will be less reliance on procedural control. For example, when investments of assets are involved, management has fewer procedural controls on which to base decisions and will need to customize contractual safeguards. Procedural control. While purchase importance directly influences procedural control, procedural control in turn has an impact on both the search for information and the extent of proactive focusing in the procurement process. It is conceptualized that the search for information as the purchaser's effort at scanning the internal and external business environment to identify or monitor issues relevant to the purchase decision there is a widespread support from a number of different perspectives for the idea that purchase importance is positively related to the search for information. Purchase importance is a central aspect of decision risk and the collection of additional information significantly reduces risk. Buying centers are larger and involve more communication for important purchases. Search for information. When there is greater procedural control related to the focal purchase, there will be less search for information for that particular buying decision. Proactive focus. Proactive focusing is the extent to which the purchasing evaluation and selection of a source of supply focus on long-range needs of the firm. A large portion of purchasing managers are strategically oriented, attesting to the relevance of this construct in a procurement context. Elaborate materials requirement planning systems and just-in-time production systems eliminate the need to consider and ponder the st strategic issues for day-to-day -day purchases. When there is greater procedural control related to the focal purchase, there will be less proactive focusing. Powerful buyers are more likely to do formal analysis on a purchase decision because they can extract needed information, such as detailed cost data, from their suppliers. Procurement decisions characterized by higher levels of buyer power will involve greater effort at formal analysis for the focal purchase. While much recent research focuses on the relational aspects of buyer-seller arrangements, there has been tremendous growth in the number of purchase transactions that rely on some form of interactive e-commerce. Many firms are now expanding their decision criteria to include evaluation of value factors other than just price. There is a need for more work on the approaches to formal analysis that buyers use to quantify and evaluate this information. 
It is perhaps tempting to think of these e-commerce situations as completely different, but when viewed from the perspective of the process model here, it is yet another application of customers seeking more power and information to do a better job of making important purchases.